Hi, I'm Ava Mrochek. I teach in the Religious Studies Department, and this is Goliath. And we invite you to join us this fall to read one of the strangest books in the world in RST 21, Hebrew Scriptures, or just Introduction to the Bible. We'll be learning about the Hebrew Bible, what Christians call the Old Testament, which is scripture for Jews and Christians. But the Bible is everywhere in our culture, whether you're religious or not. Some people use Adam and Eve to argue for what they think all marriage should look like. And almost every politician claims to love the Bible. But what does this book really say? Why has it been so important? We often assume the Bible is a nice, inspiring book full of moral lessons. But some of it really isn't like that. A lot of the Bible is kind of disturbing to read. It's got stories of extreme violence. It has graphic sexual content. And it has some texts that question whether life has any meaning at all, what to do with a world that seems unjust and absurd. So in this class, we'll let ourselves be surprised by some of the most influential literature ever written. We'll learn about how it emerged over hundreds of years in ancient Israel, in an ancient society very different from ours. But we'll also learn how it's been used in the modern world. For example, we'll learn how some people in America use the story of Noah to justify slavery as a tool for oppression. But we'll also see how civil rights leaders could use the Bible in completely opposite ways as a tool for justice. So we'll see how the same text can have different meanings depending on where you're sitting, depending on how you read. So after this course, you'll know more about the foundations of Judaism, Christianity, and Islam. And you'll be prepared to think critically about what you hear about the Bible in the media. But we'll also just enjoy some weird and wonderful literature. You don't need any prior knowledge. You don't need to be from any particular religious background. Whether you've never opened a Bible in your life or whether you had to learn all the stories in Sunday school or Hebrew school as a kid, we all have new things we can learn and new perspectives we can discover. So I hope to meet you in September.